Hello everyone. So today, Lauren and I are gonna do a fun DIY task. We went to Walmart and got these sweatsuits. Good old <laughs> time and true. Lauren got navy and we all both had the jogger pants and I got this like violet color. We had bad news everyone. The sweatsuits that we got are sold out online. But we had like a whole wall in our Walmart, so go check your Walmart. I'll also link some similar on Amazon that I think will be fun to do. So you can literally do this to anything also. It doesn't have to be a sweatshirt, you know. You can do this to random stuff you find at a thrift store. Literally whatever. Just anyway, here we go. And we're going to bleach them with Clorox, which is doubles as um, whoop, sink or toilet bowl cleaner. So <laughs> we're going to do this in our sorority house bathroom. We might get in trouble, but at this point, hopefully no one will see it until this video goes up and then... At that point? Yeah, what it? are you gonna do? We already did it. I cleaned the bathroom. <laughs> yep, you're all welcome. I bleached everything. <laughs> We're Googling how to do it. We also got rubber bands. <laughs> and I'm also gonna make a TikTok, but... Okay, so, well, I don't know. We got the gel type of uh, bleach. So I'm nervous about that because I don't think we were supposed to get the gel type bleach. This says wrap it in rubber bands. Like in a tube, like... Yeah, so it's supposed to look like that. Okay. And then you're supposed to put two parts, or one part bleach, one part water. But that's all bleach, and it's in a gel. So how do you put water in it? You're going to have to mix. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe it's already diluted. Yeah. But in we'll have to read the instructions, or the ingredients. But if you're looking at, like, a like a structure, yeah. like a carbon structure, the H's are, like, structure has, like, um, so I guess that this means our advice would be to get liquid bleach, not gel bleach. Yeah. Unless yeah. this goes really Unless, well. Yeah. <laughs> but right now we're thinking liquid bleach. I haven't done tie-dyeing <laughs> in a long time. I tie-dyed this summer. Okay, good. Yep. So you'll be the leader of this. <laughs> oh. All right. Uh, I would just like to let me know that Lauren has this purple scrunchie, so I put it on because Lauren also has a blue scrunchie, and now look at us. Ah-ha-ha. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> Unless we watched a bunch of tutorials, we got mad. None of them were freaking making sense because they were telling us how to twist things. And we didn't like it, so we're just gonna grab it in a bunch of haphazardly, um, in a bunch of different ways, and then that's gonna be it. Yeah, we're gonna see how it goes. Love you, Sue. I was gonna be watching this like. Oh. <laughs> Shoe there. <laughs> oh. At least you're in flip flops. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> what is it? <laughs> have these flip flops been here the whole dang time? And oh. I just have been walking around them. <laughs> nope, those are mine. Those are my bleaching shoes. <laughs> I would like to let me know that we are literally just squeezing this and like. We looked up methods. I yeah. Heard, I, you know, I promise. Huh. Methods are canceled. Oh. Boom. I'll do it. Yes. I'll be lovely. <laughs> okay, so I like to start out by saying that we didn't have gloves, and if you're gonna do this, you should wear gloves because bleach is dangerous. Okay, so we literally just squeezed it on with no care, as you can see. Like, we just like stuck it in crevices and we just went wild. Literally no cares in the world. I think that whenever you try and plan it out is when it didn't look as cool. So we just kind of wilded on it and we liked how it turned out. So I like the squeezy bottle a lot. I honestly would recommend this over liquid bleach because we had a lot of control over where the bleach went and then we could see the color lifting. So we just watched until we thought that we should rinse the bleach out, which ended up being around 10 minutes. But be careful because if you leave it on too long, bleach can eat through cotton. Oh yeah, we had no idea about what colors these were going to turn. But, which is part of the fun. It is part of the fun. Yeah. <laughs> Go try them all out. <laughs> okay, so this is, I'm calling it on mine. I think it's maybe been 10 minutes. I have no idea, did not time it. Okay, so I'm gonna go to the first shower. Perhaps this one. No, go to the one so it doesn't run that way. Good. Not freaking hot. Is this with Yeah. Okay. Oh. All right. Who's next? <laughs> okay. <laughs> and y'all are cutting the tops. Yes. Oh, they're cool. Yeah. That's <laughs> Which way is the front? <laughs> <laughs> this is the front. <laughs> Oh no. 
Okay, team. So we just got them out of the dryer. Washer and dryer. We washed them in cold water. I don't really know if it makes a difference, but we washed them in cold water. And now I'm about to try them on and cut them because we're gonna like cut the, crop the sweatshirts. Hey okay, everyone, not to flex, but we kind of did that. <laughs> so I'm gonna crop it and I cut a little slit. You can't even see it, but it's right here and I'm gonna cut it across there and it's gonna be cute. Hey everyone, <laughs> these are our afters. Sorry, my fake piercing hurt. <laughs> Um, okay, so we cut them, we just kind of eyeballed it and guessed, yeah. and then let's see, we put them, we left the bleach on, we don't know how long, we just looked at it, it was probably like 8 or 10, 10 minutes probably. And then we started getting scared, so we were like, we have to rinse it. Yes, <laughs> rinsed them completely, put them in the washing machine, dried them, and here we are. I'll link the exact Walmart sweatsuits that we have on, uh, but also, go look at your Walmart. <laughs> Best of luck, have some fun, grab a friend, do it, if you do it, tag me on Instagram, comment, let me know. Alright, thank you. Bye. Also, subscribe to Lauren. Oh, thank you. Bye. Also, follow me on Instagram. Bye.